Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. My fellow sisters and brothers in Islam, Assalamu alaikum. The COVID-19 pandemic has left many of us yearning to mourn and observe the tragedy of Karbala in ways that we have been accustomed to. The same expression of sorrow has been a challenge for our younger members who are left wondering, when will we return to that comfort offered by our communal setting? One such youngster has channeled his emotions through art, and that to abstract art, that showcases his feelings in a unique form of expression. Saif Khalfan from Salam Art Studio has a three-piece artwork that he has solely dedicated to Sijni for helping us raise funds for the Muharram programs. I'll let this young artist, Saif, describe his vision behind the artwork soon. But in the meantime, please join me in supporting such fresh expressions of the history and meaning behind the events of Karbala by bidding generously. I am certain his artistic expression can blend in beautifully in our living rooms, our prayer rooms, or our hallways. The starting bid has been set to $500, and the bidding period will be kept open through the end of the program. Updates on the auction will be sent periodically via the Sydney Broadcast Group on WhatsApp. The number to bid at is on display, and you will be notified immediately via text if you have been outbid. And now, let's hear about more about the artwork from Saif himself. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I'm all alone without a home. There's nowhere left to go. I am the ark of Salvation. Salam alaikum. My name is Saif Kalfan and I am Salam Art Studio. The set of paintings you see here are abstract acrylic Dutch pores in honor of our beloved third Imam, Imam Hussein. It contains the colors black, red ochre, deep red, red, copper, and gold. Each canvas size is 11 by 14 inches and has a glossy finish. Written in gold on the middle canvas is Safina Tun Naja, which means Ark of Salvation. The painting you see here is a piece of abstract art, which means it tells a different story to each person. When I look at this painting, I see pain, I see struggle. As Prophet Muhammad said, Imam Hussein is the light of guidance and Ark of Salvation. This light of guidance is helping us in our day-to-day -day lives. But the Ark, the Ark is helping us in the hereafter. Imam Hussein had so many companions who were not with him through the whole journey and joined at the last minute. The love of this holy personality made them realize that what they were doing was wrong. This Ark of Salvation sails through and saves those falling into a pit of despair and those who do fall into this Ark will have all their needs fulfilled and set on the straight path. And I'm sure in this painting's new home, the lovers of the Ahl Bayt will look at this painting hoping that their love for the Ark of Salvation will be powerful enough for him to save them in the hereafter too. Assalamu alayka ya Abu Abdullah wa ala al-arwah al-lati hallat عليك مني سلام الله أبدا ما بقيت وبقي الليل والنهار ولا جعله الله آخر العهد مني لزيارتكم السلام على الحساب وعلى علي بن الحسن وعلى أولاد الحسن وعلى أصحاب الحسن